Ladies and gentlemen, it's the Rick. Welcome back to a brand new YouTube video. And as you can see, if you guys can read, if you guys aren't blind, oh my God, we're watching Bobby Poth Game. I believe that's how you say his name. He's the guy that's known for not closing his mouth while he's playing, which is actually disturbing. I really need him to just do this. Close it because it's gross as fuck. But that's not what we're doing. We're not getting personal. We're not doing any of that. I'm just asking everybody a question. What is the point of Ricochet? What is the point of having an anti-cheat? If the anti-cheat is going to find these cheaters, which this guy is permanently banned, therefore, what does that mean? He must be cheating. If they're going to permanently ban these people, why is it even a thing if they're just going to be able to go back and play the game? This is his recent stream from seven hours ago. He got done with it. Seven hours ago. It's 6.48 in the morning for me. So he got done around almost midnight for my central standard time in Chicagoland area. He's still playing the game. Look at this guy. I mean, let me move this. Look at this dude. One, he doesn't close his mouth. He looks like a fucking freak. And he's still able to play this game. This is from yesterday. Last night. He got permanently banned just the other... I think it was yesterday morning or something. He got banned. That is on that broken building. I got him. Bro, what Where the that? fuck? Where was that? Okay, yo, right on you, x -Ruff. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. I don't even know. Uh, coming from A. Coming from A. To B. A to B. Oh, dark? From our spot. To your, uh, yeah, it, it, yeah, down this road, case on to your right. Years. That's like the biggest ADS thing. Oh, man. Tights, 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 tights. I got bomb. Where are we going? Bro, what the fuck? Where'd, uh, where'd Bobby go? Where's Bobby? I don't know. Bro, Where my account fuck? got permanently banned. What? what? Dude, I swear to God, what the fuck? How? Dude, I have no clue. I gotta at least take a picture of this. And he's still able to play the game. What is the point of Ricochet if these people are getting permanently banned, Activision knows they're getting permanently banned, and then out of nowhere, of course, top streamers are able to get their account back and begin to play. Oh, there's no false perma bans, this and that, oh, oh. Oh, yeah, I thought there was no false permabands, yet here they are playing the game. He's not the only example. There's plenty of other people. You guys remember uh, Nadia? She was permanently banned in Call of Duty. If you guys want to see that clip, here's the fucking clip. Bro. Bro, I just got banned. So I don't know if you guys remember that she was permanently banned in Call of Duty, yet now she's still able to stream, make tons of money every single day playing this game. Nadia is one of the worst of them. One of the most blatant cheaters back in the day. Now, maybe not. I don't know. I don't watch her. I don't watch cheaters, okay? But I do know she uh, she does that two box and she does the uh, she does the thing because she has 24 kills in solo trios. Hmm. Yeah, or even quads. This might even be quads, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, she's definitely legit, ladies and gentlemen. So we got Bobby Poff Gaming. We got Nadia. What about BAMs? You guys remember when BAMs was permanently banned? Here's that clip. I just got fucking perma banned. This is a test. Dude. There is no fucking way this just happened. All of these guys are getting permanently banned. Guys and gals. Nadia, I, for, I apologize. All these people are getting banned permanently live on stream, which makes it even funnier. Yet somehow Activision allows them to go back into the game even after being permanently banned because they're cheating fucking bitches full blown and continue to make thousands and thousands of dollars 
every single month. This guy has 12,000 Twitch subs, 1,000 YouTube members. This guy's making fucking bank. This doesn't include super chats. This doesn't include any ad revenue. This guy's making bank off of what? Cheating. And anybody saying he's not, like all these Warzone people are out there saying, oh my God, Bobby, he doesn't fucking cheat. He's not cheating. I, I'm best friends with Bobby. They're all top streamers, all supporting one another. What does that tell you? You got perma banned for a fucking reason. Don't say it's because of an update. Don't say it's because of this or that. You got perma banned. Nadia, you got fucking perma banned. Why are you still allowed to play the game? Bams, you got perma banned for who knows what. An unlock tool? I don't know. All these guys use unlock tools. It's fucking cheating. Why are they allowed to play the game? I don't get it. If I was perma banned, do you think Activision would give me uh, my account back? Fuck no. They want to give me my account back. Why would they give me my account back if I'm the one here talking all this shit? Why would they give a little streamer and the rest of you guys, if you were ever caught cheating, which God, I hope you don't cheat because don't be a weirdo in life. Would they give you your account back? No, they would not. But all these guys who get absolutely exposed, absolutely embarrassed on live stream, what do you think happens to them? Of course, they get their accounts back. Because why? Activision and them, they all hug each other. They all hold each other in each other's arms. And they say, are you going to make me money? Yes. Are you going to make me money? Yes. They work together to make as much money as possible. Because in the year 2024, going on to 2025, what is the most important thing in life to most people? Money. They don't care about morals. They don't care about values. They don't care about you. They don't. The average consumer, the average person playing this game, the every person watching this game, they don't care about you. It's as simple as that, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sorry to break it to you. For all you guys that love watching this mouth breather who absolutely is just, ah, oh my God, I can't even look at it. It's a, I li I'm not going to go there. I, I don't know what to tell you guys. I hope one day you can wake up. I hope one day you can actually understand why this is happening and why it continues to happen. If you don't know why, and it's 2024, and you don't know why right now by watching this video, I can't help you. Can't help you. It is what it is. Hope you guys have a great, wonderful day. I had to make a very quick video before I go to work. Some of us actually work for a living. We don't sit behind a fucking computer screen playing a game while cheating in it. That's not our style over here, ladies and gentlemen. That's not our style. Hope you guys have a great, wonderful day. If you guys haven't already, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Make sure you guys like this fucking video. Also, go follow on Twitch. We have 800 and something followers on Twitch now. We are fucking rising. We're, we're nothing but a grower always in life. We're trying to go for 1,000 followers on twitch i would greatly greatly appreciate it thank you guys so much for the recent support you guys are killing it almost to 20k subs on youtube let's go i'll see you guys in the next one have a great day it's friday enjoy it i'll see you guys in the stream this weekend i'm out peace